Oh, okay, actually, hold on. <laughs> Hello? I can't zoom in any more than that, but that is not our cat. <clears throat> Hello? Hey, it's okay. No, it's just a cat. You're okay. What? Don't act all fierce now. She always tries to act all fierce, but in reality, she's the pussy cat. Good morning, guys. How you doing? Hope you guys are having a great day. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you what I eat in a day. This isn't necessarily a bulk or a cut. Uh, this is basically just what I eat to maintain a, a fairly low body fat. So, all right, and starting with breakfast. normal breakfast, I gotta make some avocado spread. All right, so here I've got two pretty soft avocados because you wanna be able to mush them up pretty easily, right? I'm going to use two tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil, two tablespoons of lemon juice, and then a hefty amount of salt and pepper. Wait. is served so this is what I eat every single morning god literally for the past two years so basically got my oats have it every morning um, I use three packs of instant oatmeal this is two packs of Quaker strawberries and cream and one pack of Kroger original just a original kind of tones it down a little bit not as much sugar um, but this is good every morning for carbs and just have your oats every day and then over here I have got my multi-grain bread with avocado spread which you saw me make in the beginning uh, this is basically just your natural fats um, and then a rice cake and peanut butter for a little bit of protein helps you build a little bit of muscle right <laughs> That's breakfast done. Um, I'm probably gonna go to the gym today around two or three o'clock-ish. Um, so whenever I go early in the afternoon, I'll have a little bit of lunch before I go to the gym. Not a big lunch, just a little bit of food. Uh, mainly a little bit of carbs, just to give me some energy going to the gym. So I'll catch you guys at lunchtime. All right, so time for lunch. So it is currently 12.37, um, today I'm going to the gym probably around three o'clock-ish, so I'm gonna have a light little lunch here. Um, basically just gonna make a little pork sandwich. Um, got my multi-grain bread, some banana, peppers, pepperoncinis, whatever you wanna call it. Got my mayo, got my avocado spread that I made in the morning. This is just some leftover uh, pork tenderloin that I had from the last couple days. And then a sweet potato for some carbs.
my pre-workout meal. Um, I don't want a lot of food before I go to the gym because you don't want your stomach just feeling full and just kind of weighty, if that's even a word. It's probably not, whatever. <clears throat> so all I have here is a pork sandwich with some multigrain bread, some avocado spread that I made in the morning, some mayo, and some banana peppers. That's it. And this is just a sweet potato, nothing on it except salt and pepper. And that's just for some carbs to give me some energy for the gym. And of course, gotta have the water. All right, so I'm about to head to the gym. First, I'm gonna take one scoop of bucked up pre-workout. And then every day during my workout, I use Original Extend BCAAs. All right, time to head to the gym. I'm gonna work on chest today. Might do a little bit of arms in there, but mainly gonna focus on chest. Let's get it. Go dummy, go beast on them. I go beast. Go deep, I OD on them. post-workout shake. Uh, I have this absolutely every time after a workout. I've got my creatine monohydrate. I do one scoop of this, which is about five grams. And then I do two scoops of 100% isolate whey protein. So this is about 50 grams of protein. All right, so time for dinner. I'm gonna do a little quinoa chicken bowl with vegetables, stuff like that. So, I already got the chicken grilled up. I'm gonna go ahead and cut that up. I'm gonna cut up the Brussels sprouts, start steaming the veggies, and I'll start mixing everything together. chicken and the quinoa. garlic powder, you got your typical salt and black pepper, and then to finish it off, we've got some teriyaki sauce. This is what's going to give it all the flavor. All right, so now we've got our chicken and quinoa for protein, we have got our vegetables, you got your broccoli, cauliflower, carrots, and avocado, and then wash it all down with the post-workout protein shake with two scoops of whey protein and one scoop of creatine. All right, with that, I'm gonna end the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope it was somewhat helpful to kind of just show you guys what I eat every day and what I've eaten every day for the past two years to try and stay as lean as possible, but still try and keep as much muscle as I can. So, all right, with that, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.